All right, all right, y'all. Got it all cleaned up. I seen a few things over here on the curb. We're gonna grab real quick. Got us a mongoose bicycle. Definitely seen a seen some better days, but that's a Walmart special. All this right here. Working for me. Somebody had a little chicken coop or something. Rock and roll, rock and roll. That's how you started, boy. We go a little sum sum. Ooh, them brakes. Got a little squeaky. A little squeaky squeaky. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, is that a push broom? Brickets. Dry line lint removal. Someone else can have that. Oh, I'll take that broom. Yes, I will. There goes a turlet. Just saw something. Chilling, chilling. Chilling, dealing. I don't think it, it's definitely not a, a stainless sink, but it's a sink. Yeah, I got a little uh, little metal chair here. Uh, grab that sucker. Uh, yes. All right, got an old school uh, home light here. So, Got some ramps here. Oh, grab a couple ramps. Oh. Please don't look at me like I'm crazy. Oh. I'm just a little crazy. Not totally crazy. <laughs> totally. Well, we got a metal bed frame here. somebody back there excuse me hello do you mind if I take this metal bed frame I was hoping someone could scrap that okay well that's what I'm here for Perfect. All right, thank you alright All right. boy this is the big piece here We'll leave that there for now. All right, lucky for me, I got some tools. We'll take some stuff apart here. Let me get all this, uh, get this big old bed frame taken apart here and uh, we will get back at it. Yeah, cause that's just way too much crap just, just flapping around back here but we'll get it we'll get it all right yeah baby got it taken apart now we got some room room for some more stuff teach that scrap who knows best that's why i always keep my little it's actually my bmx bike bag but every allen wrench uh, uh and tool known to man pretty much in there that you'd need for a bike and all that all that took was four millimeter uh hex uh hex socket bolt thingamajigger so let's go get some more stuff yeah 
Alright, so I just roll right past here. I seen this pump. We go grab it. A pool pump. Uh, or a motor, I should say. Uh, 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 a rock. Saw a couple things over here. Get us a razor scooter. Watch your head, watch your head. Little chainsaw. Air conditioner thingamajiggers. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Do a little bit more organization here. Looks like a piece of copper. Most death. I'm gonna leave the vacuum and the other stuff. Yeah, cause all I do is just cut the cord off. And people don't like that. Especially those who want to fix vacuums and such. Toss that back there. Oh, people looking at me like I'm crazy and stuff. I guess you gotta be a little crazy. Alright, time for a little dubster diving, huh? We all say, we all say. Oh. Hey, I'll take a microwave all day long, son. It's a good looking microwave. Dish is gone. That's probably what happened. The dish done broken. It. Good weight to it, though. Nothing in the uh, in them boxes though. Yeah, I'm right, microwave. <sighs> Welcome to the truck. Welcome to the truck. Uh, yeah. <sighs> Y'all like my little stacking job? I've been slowly just working, packing it, making it look good. Trying to get as much as possible. Learning, listening to the viewers. You guys rock. Good job. Boom. All right, all right, all right. Look, somebody got some new lights. Some boots and such. Let's see, we probably get that with the stick. Ugh. Little light, little light. Uh, couple little ballasts. Some ripped up old rubber boots. Yeah, people keep telling me, Mike, you need to get some rubber boots, man. It's like, but you know what, dude? It's kind of, that's a heavy box. Uh, it's hard to, uh, you know, do stuff with rubber boots. What are these? It's all plastic. It's a filler panel. A tin pack of a filler panel. With the same thing. I don't know what those are. If they're worth anything, it's all plastic. We'll grab them, see if anybody's interested. I mean, if not, it's plastic. I can still recycle and stuff, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, what we got here, y'all? What is that? I see some copper. What is that? Direct vent automatic instantaneous water heater. 
Man, it's got some copper in it. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, look at that. A little bit of wire. A little metal panel. Yeah, there's some brass on there too. This is mostly just junk. Yuck. Ain't getting in there. That's definitely cool though. Yeah. Ooh, this one looks kind of full. Bunch of bugs, this is stuff. Oh, what is that? That's, oh my gosh, that's, oh my gosh. What the heck is that? That is so heavy. P-E-T. Oh my God, that thing weighs like 30 pounds, man. All right. I don't know what it is, but it's probably cool. That's that one I found those motors, those little gearbox things in last time. Looks like mud. There's a cord it's attached to something. What the heck? What the heck? Is this some sort of sensor? Any more things like that in here? Ah, oh, that ain't that it. That's what's cool about dumpster diving too, is like you always find stuff that you've never seen before. And then people educate you on it. Interpol. Continuous duty. Made in Denmark. Huh. Cool. Let's take it back here. Try to keep it somewhere where you ain't gonna roll around. I already know that thing gonna wanna roll around like a loose cannon and boom, all over the place. Ooh. It's one of those uh, rubber made tra Oh, look at that. Those are the. Those go with that track. Those are like for hanging tools and bicycles and such. I think I'm going to leave the, uh, the greasiness hose. Greasy hose. Greasy hose in the dumpster. Ugh. Yeah, those little rubber made track things, those aren't cheap, man. Got it. I see a little bit of stuff in here. A little bit of scrap. This is tossed in the back of the truck there. Let's see what we got here. Ugh. Slides, hooks. Those almost looks like the same hooks that go to that rubber made. Oh, they say hyper tough. 
I wonder if it's a universal type of fit. Some trim nails. God, I hope they don't open up in the back of the truck. Just go everywhere. Look at all these boxes, man. It's like decent boxes. Decent boxes. Oh, I already got tons of boxes, though. I got here. Standing on something. Oh, whatever it is, it's heavy. Battery charges. Take those. A little power cord. Paperwork. Who needs that? Oh, look at that. That was another one. Another battery charger. Wow, those are some pretty decent boxes, man. Ah, I know where to get boxes. I get plenty of them all day long, son. All right. Wow. Up, 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 up. Let's close it up here. Just to be nice. Because Mike is nice. Uh oh, we got a bunch of bubble wrap. More bubble wrap. Lots and lots and lots of bubble wrap and stuff. Oh, I see metal up in here. Oh, I do, I do, I do, I do. Looks like aluminum or some stainless. Uh, or maybe it's none of the above. Let's see. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not any of the good stuff, actually. go to Shh. quiet why well, finna addicted to this bubble wrap again we just came through here oh my god Yeah, 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 guys. Oh, oh, oh. 
It's a little slick, getting a little slick up in here, y'all. Watch your head, watch your head. Yeah, something tells me that this Not stainless, not aluminum, but it's still scrap. What up, air hose? Air water hose. Junk, 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 junk. Somebody got a new uh, radio arm saw. Ooh, that box is heavy. Don't tell me they left the stand in there. Nope. <laughs> I was about to say, holy cow. I left the whole sand of the thing in there. I see a tire and a Jew. <sighs> all right, all right. Like one of my favorite dumpsters. There you go, guys. Uh. Looks mostly empty. But... Uh. There goes something. Looks expensive. Uh. All these boxes are empty there. minute show dude can shoe Wired. Let's get out of the box. 
snow in here. Get the wires. A little bit of, little bit of something, something right there. Box. Definitely gonna need a shower after this one. Yeah, not a whole lot happening up in here tonight. That's all right though. We'll be back, we'll be back, we'll be back. Oh, those are empty, 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 empty. Uh. more wire not much not much oh look at that some bits good stuff there all right all right now we're just reaching now we're just digging in trash all right got a few things got a few things Sure, what those are, but we'll take them. Uh, uh, a few things. Not the best, but. Got some stuff. Probably that recycle thing's full. All right. Anybody need a couch? I guess see something. Get the stick. Look like a little motor or actuator or something. Probably because it's like a a motorized. Uh... Uh. What is that? Motor. 
scoop her out. Scoop out the motor. Uh. Almost. Come on, motor. Under this couch. Oh, the love seat. I don't see it. I don't know what that is. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Take that. I'd put that thing in the couch, or a, uh, the couch in the dumpster, but it wasn't there when I found it. I don't feel like dealing with all that. Sure. Uh, sometimes you got some stuff in these crates. Let's hop in here. Wash out for nails. Yeah, nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, these boxes. Whoa. Oh. oh, they're like a little exhaust, uh, exhaust pipe. There's a box going over the side of here. It's a whole motor, y'all. Oh, it's bolted to the... Look at that. That's a whole that's a whole motor. Yeah, we ain't getting that out. Not tonight. Ugh. Oh, that's bananas right here. There's a cylinder. Holy cow, that's a, that's a cylinder right there. Easily five, six hundred pounds. Not coming out. Not coming out. <sighs> Whoa. Let's see what we got here. <sighs> All right. We got a couple of things. To, we're at the back of the truck up there. Whew. Woo. Yeah. That'll make a little room. Let's get this big guy in there first. Uh, 
Whew. Ah. Yeah. Whew. Now that is a heavy piece of equipment. Well, all righty, scavengers, another successful evening getting some stuff out there. We kind of mix it up for y'all. Got a little bit of curbside, a little bit of dumpster diving, and it actually uh, seems to have uh, paid off quite well. Uh, like I said, we started off curbside, got us uh, some good scrap back there, got a motor, got a sink, got that bed frame. We took that apart. Uh, thank God, that thing was huge. Uh, she so had a little pump motor. The little ramps back there. I'm gonna probably hang on to those. Uh, little uh, portable AC. That thing's definitely seen some better days. Got some power tools. Little home light. Little Poulet Pro chainsaw. You know, nothing, nothing too crazy to shake a stick at. Uh, but I think some of the coolest stuff we found was probably the dumpster find stuff. Uh, we'll go ahead and start off here with this, uh, these HP things. I looked these up, found these out. They're HP 1U Universal Filler Panel. Uh, these, I believe, from what I could tell, go into like server racks when you have a uh, little, you know, blank spaces. Instead of having just empty slots, you could fill these in. Uh, you know, just to fill it in so you don't have your blank spots, but we got three boxes full of those. Be curious to see. Uh, they don't. They don't. They don't appear to be too expensive. Uh, I think I looked them up. Few bucks a piece, but I mean, there's a few of them there. Uh, got this water heater over here. Ugh. It's a, a tankless water heater. That's what that is. And boy, you can tell right now. It's got some good stuff. This thing is definitely worth taking apart. Getting that scrap out of there. Yeah, copper, wires, copper, I see aluminum. Probably some stainless. All kinds of all kinds of good stuff right there. Uh, set, that, uh, set that down. Yeah, there's some brass on the bottom. So yeah, this guy's definitely gonna need some work to take it apart. Uh, we got the uh, the little Rubbermaid fast track. Like I said, these these aren't the most inexpensive of things. These are great for having around the garage. They slide on something like that. Although that is a hyper tough. That's not. This is the one that goes on the. Uh, the track here put on your track hang it on your wall hang your bicycles your tools you name it there's a few of them a few of them in here a lot of them though are this uh don't seem to quite go with it but i think i have another Another couple pieces somewhere there that go to this. So we're going to hang on to that for sure. Definitely got some resale value. Uh, this really heavy thing that we couldn't figure out what it was. I looked it up by the part number. I don't know why it's so heavy. If you look underneath it, it looks like it's just full of metal plates. But this is a docking station for like a Panasonic TV. And I'm thinking it's really, really old because when you look it up, like they're not available anymore you can buy like used used stuff or whatever but yeah it's definitely definitely got some weight to it uh this guy over here roller i looked it up why well, didn't look it up it says interpol uh it's a um a power roll so i'm guessing it's some sort of like roller for maybe a conveyor system Electrical or whatever. I put the magnet on it There's a little bit of uh, like all that that's just uh, Scrap right there 
but there's a little bit of uh non-ferrous in there but i don't know if i could take that thing apart or not that thing looks like it's put together pretty well uh got this over here the mufflers the mufflers we pulled out of the one dumpster that had that huge motor that just uh that thing just wasn't coming out i mean that was gonna have to have a forklift someone put it in with a forklift even if I had a little boom lift in the back, I still don't know if I'd been able to get that thing out just because of the dumpster height. It was so, so tall. Uh, but total bummer to have to leave that behind. But, you know, it is what it is. Uh, let's see. But we did end up we did end up pulling out this huge cylinder here. It says it's a searing cylinder. Most likely for a, uh, a tractor or a bulldozer or a uh, dump truck or or something but yeah this is it goes up and down it's a hydraulic cylinder and i guess it's for the for the steering of the uh the equipment man but that thing was heavy 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 and then we got a little box of some goodies over here we'll go through uh in the one dumpster we usually find cameras and such didn't find too much but we did find some some wires more uh more wiring harnesses these little boxes right here like that's that's all aluminum i can tell you that right now uh and then this box let's see yeah those are wires those look like antenna type wires more wires more wires and more wires 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 this says it's a uh, a battery unit it's no battery more like a uh, docking station maybe maybe that's the uh yeah and that's empty there ain't nothing in there so yeah no batteries in there but lots of wires Electronic scrap, more wires. We did get one camera, one little camera out of there. Usually we get a whole lot more, but you know, it is what it is. And then all these over here, I say these are, yeah, we got some automatic battery chargers. We'll plug them in, see if they work. If not, definitely scrap them out. One of these I think was like a jumper. Yeah, die hard. Nope, that's a charger too. To me, it looked like it would need like a battery or something, but I guess not. And then there's another battery charger, 25 amp battery charger. So we got three battery chargers out of that one dumpster there. Ugh. And then, uh, you know, just uh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Got some chairs, old mongoose bicycles, all rusted out. Uh, maybe sell it for parts five bucks ten bucks who knows maybe but uh for the most part yeah just some scrap some good scrap good scrap and a couple of resale items uh but all in all i'd say i'd say it was a pretty successful evening out there uh yeah it took me a little bit but we did it we actually we, we made it happen again but uh anyways uh, alrighty scavengers well that is going to do it for this episode of dumpster diving and curbside scavenging i hope y'all uh enjoyed the uh the little mix of both of them that was pretty cool pretty good for me too I actually worked out pretty well you know drive around while there's still light people putting stuff out right after work getting that scrap and then uh you know heading over to the dumpsters afterwards and then getting a few more things but uh all in all i mean i'd say we i'd say we made a few bucks definitely made a few bucks not not too bad not too bad but uh anyways well already guys that's gonna do it uh like i said on this uh curbside dumpster diving extravaganza uh i'm your host with the absolute most mike the scavenger thank you so much for tagging along as always it was a total pleasure be sure to like the video subscribe to my channel uh share it with your friends instagram check it out i got one uh bah, 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 bah. uh extra special shout out to everybody about some merch appreciate that if you're interested down below teespring uh got some stickers t-shirts if y'all want to help out you know 
go check it out get you something and uh, like I was saying uh, on yesterday's video don't have a P.O. box don't send nothing to that P.O. box because they're probably going nuts at the Postal Service I hate the Postal Service it is what it is maybe I'll look at getting a post office or a little P.O. box at like the UPS store or something I don't know but all in all I got a little bit of work cut out for me today uh, but luckily I don't have to go to work so I'm gonna do my thing clean some stuff up uh, maybe we'll do a video I still have this uh, big monitor back here I was gonna do you know we're gonna do a video taking it apart on I know I'm just just dragging my feet here and there but I still have it and we're still gonna do it and then I think this waterless uh, uh, this tankless water heater will probably do a video taking it apart because that's definitely got some stuff worth uh, getting out of for shizzle but uh, anyways well alrighty guys uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Um, we're gonna try to hit it again maybe tomorrow maybe I don't know we'll see what the weather the weather's doing you know it's springtime and uh, you know the rain here in Texas in springtime, it comes, it goes. Well, they say April showers bring May flowers. So, yeah, April is upon us. Uh, March is almost over. So, crazy. Time is just flying by. But anyways, y'all stay tuned for that next one. And in the meantime, y'all be safe. Do all kinds of cool stuff, but don't be crazy. And uh, go out there, get that scrap, get that free money, and uh, make it happen. But uh, anyways, all right, y'all take care. Peace. 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 What we got here, y'all? Those scrappy scrappy.